Number 78, Brett Toth, extra lineman, and Toth clears his man out, and Wolfolk does not go down. Darnell Wolfolk, number 33, goes for just three, but gives his team a touchdown lead. Out here, third and four. Perry goes to the left and then cuts it back to the right. He's got a first down and an open field. Malcolm Perry going to take it all the way. Touchdown, Navy. Third down and three. Perry keeps it into the secondary. Off to the races again. Can he get another one? Tripped up at about the 11-yard line, or he would have scored. I think right at the end, I think it was number 50, Bale Wolf, that just barely made the tackle. No, it was actually number 59 that time to the outside. Voigt that hustled all the way. The outside defensive end, Voigt made that tackle. Think about that. A defensive end running down the field just clips. Second and goal at the nine. The late pitch, finally a pitch. John Trainer, and he spins close to the goal line. We finally get an option, and he almost scores. <laughs> That's... Well, we've had one pass for Army and one pitch for Army, and they both worked. I thought this was stopped in the backfield. But at the last second, it goes. Perry digging in his spikes, and he dropped the ball. And now he's heading to the first down and more. First down, Navy. Holy cow. Might have been the greatest bobble ever. Yep. The play was supposed to go to the right side. He drops it, and then he's by himself, one-on-one -on -one to the outside, no one really there. And the athletic skills of Perry, oh my God, yes. Look up to the heavens, because that was an answered prayer there. For the win. Mooring, 48-yarder. Second year has won it. Brett Mooring had enough leg. He hit it. He pushed it just a little bit left. He hit it beautifully, didn't he? You have to know this. Without the two penalties, if he was 10 yards closer, the angle would have been good enough that it would have been in. Plenty of leg, but wide left.